Moments of chaos ended with an arrest in Sullivan County. Police arrested a man who they say is wanted as a person of interest in an attempted murder in Muncie, Indiana. News 10's Aaliyah Blackburn has more on what happened. The moments leading up to this scene in Sullivan County started early. Sullivan County Sheriff Clark Cottom tells News 10 it began with a tip from Delaware County Sheriff's Department. They were looking for an individual that they had reason to believe could be headed to the Sullivan County area. That person is identified as Gregory Greider of Muncie, Indiana. Cottom says he's the person of interest in an attempted murder that happened 630 Sunday morning in Muncie. Our investigators uh, and Jasonville Police Department investigators set up a uh, stakeout on the residence here where they believe they may be en route to. The vehicle police were looking for arrived within a few hours at a home on Hickory Street in Hymera, Indiana. Cottom says they conducted a felony stop and two women were safely taken out of the vehicle. Once they were out of the vehicle, the suspect uh, slipped over into the driver's seat of the vehicle in an attempt to flee. He backed the vehicle up and struck the Jasonville uh, City Police car. Uh, the two vehicles collided. Cottom says Greider tried to ram the police car for the second time. A Sullivan County deputy uh, who was in the Jasonville car at that time um, stepped from the Jasonville car and fired one round into the suspect vehicle. Police say Greider took off southbound in the vehicle, crashing it at this intersection along Hickory and Depot Street. Cottom says he took off running, leading police on a chase, and was caught and arrested without incident. It was a very dangerous situation. Uh, we're very fortunate that no one was um, uh, injured uh, or killed here today. A chaotic scene ending with a wanted man in police custody. In Sullivan County, with photojournalist Joseph Dames, Aaliyah Blackburn, News 10. Cottom tells us that the investigation is now being turned over to Indiana State Police. Officials say another person also wanted in connection to the attempted murder was arrested by the Delaware County Sheriff's Office.